You cannot come to my house after 6 a.m. as my best. Because I have learned from besties. You cannot come to my house and form sleeping over. My bestie, you cannot... <laughs> see, no, seriously. My bestie, you cannot okay. laugh and rob my husband unnecessarily ah, and form that no. you are laughing. No, you oh, know that thing they always do. It's like yes. testing yes. the water. It's like testing yes. the water. Yes. Yes. Are you serious? Yes. Yes. Who does that? From there, it's an exchange. Mm. Hey everyone, welcome to another segment, another episode of Bold to Say. My name is Omar Silewa Olenyemi, and today I have my guest with me, my sweet and lovely guest today to discuss interesting topics. So let's meet our guest. I'm Lee Con Richard. Hi, I'm Sarah Odira. You can also call me Sarah Opokam. So our topic for today is how to set boundaries between your spouse and your friend. So hi guys. Hey. Hi, hi, hi. Yes, uh, coming into your home or allowing your friend come into your home is not a bad idea. But anytime my friend is coming into my home, I must be around. There is no reason why you should come into my home when I'm not around. Okay, let me ask this question. Okay. What if that's your friend? Okay. Happens to be the friend of your spouse. You know that bestie of it. I don't like her hearing this. I hate it. Bestie later turns to you know when things start happening, it will be like magic. But it's a gradual process. Someone I used to say already has the motive. The order does not have. So the one that has the motive that I'm ending in that Jerusalem will continue pursuing it gradually, gradually. If a friend of mine calls me, ah, oh boy, I'm late. He's running late. Ah, I don't know. I have any place to go. Go and find a, an hotel or a, anywhere to lodge. A man. Because there's no reason for you coming into my house. The guy might be bringing issues. I lighting things to me that see your wife did not dress well, your wife did not eat this, your wife is not a praying pattern. So, you know, then I might even I'm not even saying it on the other. I might even be using that word that my guy is telling me against my wife. Or maybe he comes mm. to sleep over and then in the morning he just wakes up and give her breakfast in bed. And she'll be like in that, your own entire life, you have never done you. that. You have never given me breakfast in bed. That's the reason why I said there is no reason why you should sleep over. Uh, this boundary thing is, is very complicated. Okay. For me, you're my friend. The day I want, I say, okay, this is who I'm getting on with. Blah, blah, blah. His name ceases to be Michael to you. Yes. His name becomes Mr. Michael. Okay. Yes. Okay. I'm okay. 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 That is a very deep boundary. And if you have to call him Michael, it may be because you're a senior, you have to call it a fool. Brother, you're not going to call my my spouse Mikey. My, <laughs> Romantic no, not starting name. Mikey. Okay. Don't mm. give him a nickname on my behalf. Mm. Don't cut his name short on my behalf. Mm. Call his full name. His name is Michael. Call it Michael. That's his name. He can be Mikey to me. He can be Miko to me. He can be whatever to me. <laughs> to you, he is Michael. Sure. So you respect that. Sure. So we start from the name. And then unnecessary familiarity. He ends. Yeah. Unnecessary hanging out ends. Even if we have been friends and we all work together, you cannot have my bestie's number either as my spouse. So the focus is not only on my bestie. The focus is on both of us. Because if my bestie is not the one planning it, my spouse yeah. can be the one planning it. We often forget that we are Africans. Mm. We, sh we, we choose the ones that favor us. Mm. When we want to use the African culture, we use the one that favor us. Yeah. But when it is going against us, That's we choose the, the modern language That's that we borrow. You know, Africans, naturally, when you get married, there is this respect that comes with it. Yes. There is this respect that comes with responsibility, whether you are the wife or the husband. I think respect you are having to the name is not because you, you have the, the urge to respect somebody, but to bring boundaries. Yes, 
Then the romantic aspect is coming in. Now, this is a maid that you employ as your maid. Father me. Okay. You see him like this. As your maid. She's calling him by his name. And now when I say maid, this is a maid that is by far my junior. So what do you call that? So do you need somebody to tell you that there's something going on? Definitely, definitely, that one is sure. Now, how do you defend the fact that you would tell people that nothing is going on between the two of you when she has gone from the point of calling you sir to calling you a nickname? No, I'm not saying by name. Nickname. Nickname. My own is let there be boundaries. How do you say boundaries, my dad? Okay, as simple as. You don't come to my home when I'm not available. Um, I was reading the story. Somebody said uh, that um, she needs money and then she calls the friend's husband. And not call and your friend. You did not call me that you need help. You call my husband. From where to so where? where? As how? How? Why can't you call me? Then if I feel that I don't, I don't have at that moment, I could ask him, can you help me? Then you help my friend. friend. Then you have crossed the boundary. Yes. Oh, that's well, enough. Yes, yes, that's enough. The boundary. So, even if you are in my home, you don't get up and go to my kitchen and serve my husband. You don't go to my home and serve him. Let him serve himself. I said, I'm like, okay, can you help me? Which that will not happen. Mm -hmm. Let me do my job myself. I had a friend that came for a sleepover one time. And just entered into my own private bedroom oh. and then picks the broom. I want to lay my bed. I say, I'm to come. I say, I'm and that was the last time. Yeah. What, 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 why, why should you sleep my bedroom? Yeah. For what? I what are you looking for? Yes. Even if you are my family member, you don't, my bedroom is my sacred place. You don't go there. Even if it's my mom, you will not sleep on my bed. Mm. Because that is my altar, mm -hmm. that is my sacrament area. Word. So you see, most of these things, those are the boundaries we are also talking about. Because you're my friend, and I tell you, feel at home. You now over feel at home. Hmm. You now over start wearing brown pants. In my house. <laughs> hey! <laughs> you know hey. wear one bomb shot oh, that is exposing everything. That is Gaga. That is exposing every step to hair. Hey, especially when I don't have enough. Hey, I don't have like this. I'm freaking out exposing. My sister, we are in job. Yeah. We are in job. My brother, please cover up. Setting a boundary of not reporting each other to friends. Yeah. It's very, very important. Third parties. Because when you start. Reporting yourselves, okay. I come, come and settle this between the two of us. Yes. And then the person already knows that there is a loophole for me to penetrate. Mm. If truly you love each other, settle your rifts between each other. Mm. Don't take it out. When it comes to relationship, when it comes to career, every other thing, tell your friend, let them help you out. But when it comes to relationship, immediately you start saying it to your friends. You know, there is this sentiment still you have. They might like this, your husband, they might be supporting him against you. Not because what the husband is doing is right, but because they just want that relationship to break. Okay, there's this story that was trending on social media recently, earlier on. Yeah. Well, there are actually two. The first one was um, that she, her friend, left her husband. After after like several issues in the marriage, and she kept advising her stay. You guys don't have any problem, but she refused and decided that she was going to end the marriage. And she eventually moved out of the marriage. And the friend, seeing an opening, seeing that this guy is a loving guy, he's a good guy, he's a cool guy. And then she decided, and she one way or the other, Find something happened. Find a way. And they started having something. In fact, planning to get married. Well, something like that. Eh? 
I will not blame the lady. That, Which one? That uh, went for the guy. Okay. I mean, a lot of times we don't appreciate what we have until we lose it. Yes. yes. Now, you are going to pick uh, stones when you have pearls with you. Mm. Bruh, the friend was not advising her to leave. Mm. She was saying, yes. stay. stay. Because she, she gets angry. As she can't carry herself water, person will get eye, see treasure, he pick the treasure. Why did they get it? Pounds are not full of signs. Why is it that it is that one that I'm interested in her? But in this scenario, the other lady that, that, that is the friend turned wife to be, I say that the friend is at fault. Right? Yes. She has advised her several Keep this. Correct your ways. You are not willing really to do that. And as guys, we are open to you. The <laughs> guys might <laughs> <are> always <laughs> you know, in the moment so that goes to your go back, you are screaming. If if she has seen other men, will she go for them? It means that she has been there. It not means that she, she not seen any guy. Now her, now her friend hold the sweetheart. Because she has been seeing all the lapses, like you guys see, tell him the friend that will let's call my husband did this, my husband did that, my husband did this. That is why she, she will not tell me she did not see another person that is willing or willing to do. Why you see that she's now waiting for that one? But is that part the, the ones that she saw that they are ready and willing to do, are they what she wants? Are they what she wants? So it is her friend. Let me die for your husband. Let me die for your husband. Okay, <laughs> if that friend eventually marries that guy, nobody will hear that story. Yes. Nobody will hear that quarrel. Nobody will hear any negative thing about them. Even if she went through anything, she will settle it by herself because she knows what she cannot But some ladies are crazy. So I know that lady, she could move from one person. To another, find suit and expose the person on social media, everything, social media, relationship. And the next minute, if it's not working, she'll move to another person and she start fronting, doing the same thing again, front the person on social media. So, some ladies, they don't have shame. Look at this one, this this story that was trying to make, this second story that, um, that she, her friend came to put her cords, to skirts, yeah, and yeah, eventually yeah. they have accidental sex. Accidental sex. I mean, what is the meaning of accidental sex? I, out of the two of them, one is already out of the mind. Straight up. There's nothing like accidental sex. At all. Accidental so sex. Has, has, someone already had a plan. It's just the other person that is falling into the trap. So, ladies, stop telling your female friend who is funding you. Mm. Mm. Whoever is funding you, stop telling them. Mm. Your mouth, you just bought me this. You just bought me that. that, 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 that. Everyone the one interested that. in getting that you part too. You start doing that. Oh. You are inviting them because you are putting ideas on their head. Okay, so I hope we have been able to trash this topic today. So let's move to the next segment, which is our game oh. session. Oh. <laughs> are you bold enough? So this is our game session. Are you ready? Let me get a question. Oh yeah, my God. Yeah. I'm scared now. Ah. My heart is scared. <laughs> my heart is looking. I don't like this. So who's going first? I'm going first. I'm on IB. I don't know. Ha ha. Sing any song of your choice. Ah uh ah. -uh. <laughs> Any, any song? Any song. Oh my god. Lonely I did talk. Lonely, lonely, lonely. Money on my mind. Money, money, money. 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 Your voice say I'm Particular to call me, call me, call me. I'm on the road, but you might have a high On a lot of the man, you know. Everyone's 
Yes, 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 I love that. I love that. I love that. Much better as space times six. Ah, uh, uh, six times six is thirty-six. 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 Thirty-six.